Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Liverpool Career Mode here on FIFA 18. My name's Dave and welcome to Mimongo Gaming. Right, a few things I need to address off the bat. Now, I'm going to put this, you know, like when I've done it before with um, the little poll that I have up there. Lex like XL has asked for me to include like three games in an episode um, because he says that I'm kind of making this like sort of go a bit a, a slow pace or whatever whereas like a lot of like obviously streamers not streamers youtubers and stuff um are into like obviously their second season already and stuff like that because i don't like put a video up every day now obviously if i do that it's one it's either still going to be 20 minutes long and we won't have as much like gameplay or i make it a little bit longer and we get three matches in or you come up with maybe another option i don't know what that would be but you'd have to put that in the comments so i will just put do you want three games yes or no in an episode um and then it's down to you guys then and i'll and i'll go for it and i'll put three games in no problem so it'll be two games today just so that we get the vote and i hope lex is all right with that i just want to get this vote out so that everyone's happy with with the format uh, and, and we'll move on from from there like basically like you know what I mean now yeah I got a little bit <laughs> a little bit angry again um, in the last episode and I've actually had a warning yes I've had a warning from YouTube with my um, about my um, use of language should I say so I've got to maybe try and calm things down take it easy um, and not get so wrapped up which is a shame because you know um, I think it just gives something to the game, but anyway, guys, um, just letting you know that I'm going to try and be calm, but I, emotions take over, don't they? Do you know what I mean? And a lot of the anger, I think, is not at the fact that Liverpool are losing, it's more of the fact that of anger towards myself in the fact that I'm trying to do something and because of my injuries and stuff like that, it, my arm doesn't do what it's my brain is telling me to do at the right time and things like that so i get a little bit angry myself and i'm sorry guys you know what i mean for that so without further ado and by oh yeah before i forget also um we had a couple of injuries um as well Gretzka and timo Werner. if you noticed in the last episode luckily they were only minor ones Werner was out for two days Gretzka was out for five so i have like literally just kind of fast forwarded it up to like the point where we're about to play the match and as you can see Timo Werner is inside and so is Goretzka so that is great thank god like you know what I mean a little bit of luck on my side for a change like sort of thing so this is the side now you're probably thinking hold on what's wrong with the formation I'm gonna try it because we're away we're at Old Trafford I'm playing a little bit deeper it might not work I can always like flick it around and change it like you know halfway through the match or whatever sort of thing but I just thought I'll try it because Man United are going to have a much stronger side than we are, but, you know, I'm going to give it everything we can. Because if I can beat Manchester United today, guys, it closes that gap and it gives us a real good shot at going for this Premier League title. And that will make up for the loss of coming out of the Champions League. <laughs> so, without further ado, guys, um, let's get into this episode. So, this is the Manchester United lineup. The reason I didn't say anything in that, as I've speeded that up, you've probably like figured it out. Just to give you an idea of like the, the, the Manchester United lineup, anyway. But that's who we're up against. Okay, so here we go. It's the biggest rivalry in English football, I I believe, and I think a lot more people believe it as well. It's like it, it's like the El Clasico of like England, where it's like Barcelona and Real Madrid. This is like Liverpool, Manchester United, two of the biggest clubs like in English football. So let's get this underway and let's see if we can show them what's for. Okay, it is raining and stuff like that, so there's going to be maybe a few errors. This is a great ball down the line. Oxley chamberlain okay. Plays this in low. Oh, great opportunity from Correa. Surely that's a pe not a penalty, but a free kick. Robertson. Can he get past? Oh, he's done well. Can he find anyone? It's a chance. Okay, headed it straight into the ground, Mr. Chamberlain. Robertson does well to pick him out far post. Mm, could have done better. 
All right, well, we're on top at the moment, which is a good thing. 16 minutes in, and we're doing all right. Gress is having a really good game so far. Considering who they've got in their midfield, he is bossing it. Oh, Coutinho! Oh, I couldn't get it round. Onto his right foot so he could, like, finesse that. There we go. Half time, guys. Nil nil. Well, to be fair, they've only had one real attempt, I think. Right, here we go. Here we go. Come on. Second half. Matic, they're uh, at home. They know if they beat us, our title chances are, are, are very, very minimal. Right, it's Oxley Chamberlain now. What can he do? He can turn inside. Can he pick anyone out? He goes back. Goretzka. Oh, it's blocked. Great block from Smalling. He just threw himself on the ground and blocked that. Oh, nice from Goretzka again. Getting the better of Mkhitaryan. Coutinho cuts this inside. Goretzka. All right, Pereira. Can he go this way? Um, okay, maybe lock this back. Oxley Chamberlain. Okay, finesse. Oh! I thought he'd done it. I thought he beat it because he'd beaten De Gea and I thought he was going to drop in. Oh, that's the closest we've come. Ricardo Pereira inside. Right, Correa turns this. Timo Werner is going. Timo Werner goes for the low drive. Are you kidding me? DeMarcus gets there before Coutinho. I went for the low drive. Hoping that it would bounce out to one of my players. And DeMarcus gets there before Coutinho. I've, trying, I've changed the formation slightly and pushed um, like Coutinho and, and Oxley chamberlain up, up a little bit further. like Because I, I think we've got a good chance here. But I'm just hoping that doesn't catch us out at the back. Good chance. Ah, oh, no one there again. Be nice to score a corner. Okay, here's Van Dyke. Can he Oxley Chamberlain? Can he pick anyone out? The chance. Oh, is that Werner at the far post? It was Werner at the far post. Pogba's now coming off and Lukaku's coming on. So they've got two up front with uh oh, can we get something from this corner? Probably not. Bailey whips this in. Virgil van Dijk. It's the bar. He hits the bar. De Gea's beaten. Oh, just a half a foot lower. And it's in. Uh, don't know what he's doing. Oh. Ben Woodburn. What can he do? Cuts this inside. Timo Werner can't. No, look at the hair, he's going to get it. Don't blow. Gretzka. Great chance, Bailey. Pull back, come inside. Pick someone out. Correa hits it. Oh, for God's sake. Werner. Ben Woodburn. Oh, no. Nil nil guys. We had the better chances. Ben Woodburn right at the end. If only his shooting was on. If only that was like Mane or Salah on that wing. I even moved a bit closer, like I mean to the goal and Ben Woodburn still skies it and I didn't even like hold it down like that hard. Oh well. We've we haven't closed the gap because we've got the same points. But we should have done. We were much the better team in that. Look at are you, are you kidding me? Are you are you looking? Can you see this? Because if you can't see this, like you know what I mean? I I mean are you are you looking above how hard I tried to win that game? I had 23 shots. Which is like the most I think I've had in FIFA 18 up to now. I mean, nine on target. I mean, that's obviously not the good thing. But still, look how many Man United had. You know what I mean? And it's like the amount of possession we had um, at Old Trafford. And we come away with a nil-nil. I mean, <sighs> Robertson. 
A defender gets man. Well, that kind of sums it up, doesn't it? A, man, a defender getting man of the match. Oh well. What did? Um, how many saves did uh, De Gea make? Eleven. Eleven saves he made. I mean, that's even bizarre. Look at their like like final like lineup. Why have they got Matic up front instead of Lukaku? Or Rashford up front, even. I mean, that's... Okay, that's weird. That's FIFA for you. That's what you need to be training on. Ooh, Gallo's shooting up. Nice. Bound to him. He's down in the 50s. Bound to shoot up. Okay. What's this? Disappointed. That was upsetting not to get in the team. I respect your judgment, but I really want to play that one. I, I get it, you know, but, you, you know. Okay, so this will be the lineup um, going against Crystal Palace. And Barco's back from. He was really, really tired, so I couldn't really play him. And people would be saying, like, oh, you should have played him in, in the Man United game. But he was just. It was all the way down. It was like literally a centimeter of like, like fitness. So that was the reason why. Um, if you're just wondering. Okay, so. Uh, yeah, I think the green and white. Don't want to get a clash on this. And we're away again. Okay, so. Let's see how we can get on against Crystal Palace. So, let's see if we're any, doing any better against Palace than we did against Manchester United. I mean, we had all the attempts, but we just couldn't hit the back of the net. So, fingers crossed we can do something today, guys. Oh, Roy Hodgson there. Ex-Liverpool manager, yeah. Don't know why the hell we got him as a manager, I've no idea. Okay, cut inside, cut inside. Pick out someone, small off turn. Wayne Hennessy does well to just push that wide. I need to move around a bit more to give myself opportunities. I'm, I'm just not doing it at the moment. I don't know why. Let's go here, Bailey, whip this in. Chance to... Yes, I placed it. Because Bailey was like, took the corner, you know when like Van Dijk hit the crossbar in the Man U game and I placed the, the, the little yellow circle where it was it, and it's and this time Tar has, has buried it. Nice. I mean some people could say he was backing into the player behind him but no, I mean that player should have been in front of him. So, nice one. Is that his first goal for us? I don't know actually. First league, first Premier League goal anyway. I'm not sure if it's his first goal, but nice one. Jonathan Tarr there. Proving what a great defender. And now. Oh, and Barker does well to cut that out. Uh, nearly. Anderson. Pereira. Bailey inside. Coutinho back to Bailey. Let's do some quick passing. He, oh, it failed. <laughs> I was just getting carried away. Brannig okay, Brannigan goes this way. Gomez, there's a run here from Coutinho. Can he get the finesse shot? Oh, it's fallen to Smolov. We'll take two. Thank you. Luck has actually turned our fate in our favour this time. Oh, it fell to him. Oh, it was actually the defender. I think it was Ryderveld, was it? That blocked it instead of Venice. And it fell back to Smolov, who says, thank you very much. 2-0. Nice one. Sorry if my voice is a bit weird. I think I'm picking up a bit of a cold and getting a sore throat. So, continue. Oh, he was through, but then it's played it back to Wijnaldum, who lays this off. And Brannigan's going to hit this. And unfortunately... <laughs> okay. Um, it goes wide. Um, and we know he's got a good um, long shot on him, because he scored some crackers early on in the season. Okay, it's working all right, guys. It's working okay. But yeah, I can definitely feel my throat is going. <laughs> um, oh, that's a poor Smolov. Thank you. That was such an error from them. I don't know what the hell they were thinking. But he has obviously got a long shot on him. Man. It's two for Smolov. Well. What is going on here? Lazy, I don't know what... I don't know what they were doing there. Smolov says thank you very much. Bang. Thank you. Nice one. 
3 0. Well, what is it? Why couldn't we have done this against Man United? Maybe because I didn't play small off. And maybe I should have done. But, you know. But then again, um, Crystal Palace are making a hell of a lot more errors than what Manchester United were. De Vry with a great header. Coutinho lays this out to Barco. Can he surge forward? Okay, come on. Get back inside. Coutinho wants this. He's looking for the layoff. Brannigan. Back to Coutinho. No, back to Bailey. Damn it. Okay, Pereira. Can he find Bailey? He's going to find. Smolov, is he onside? He's onside. What is. What is going on here? Pereira, lovely little back heel. Bailey sees him. I thought he was offside. I honestly did. I thought, oh shit, he's offside. Because he looked like he was offside, but someone was obviously playing him on there. <laughs> we are 4-0 up. What is going on? The last match, 0-0. Loads of attempts, stuff like that. I think it's probably because De Gea is not in goal, like in the got Wayne Hennessy, but you know. I'm finding maybe I should be calmer, you know, because if, if I am calmer, I seem to be concentrating more. They are not concentrating. Come on, there's a great chance through. It's Barco. He's gone for the chip. Oh, <laughs> being cocky now. Barco went for the chip. Wow. I mean, I'm maybe enjoying it more when I'm calmer. Uh, and that's why I'm, I'm finding the right manoeuvres, I don't know. Uh, Brannigan, uh, here's Barco. Smolov wants this, inside. Can he get there? Oh! <laughs> oh my god. He just got ahead of Hayden Hennessy and I thought I put too much power on the pass across to Bailey. But it was just enough. Smolov is having a absolute uh, an awesome game. He's, he's, he's scored a hat-trick, and he's now set up Bailey as well, who hit it with a shin, but it went in. 5-0. What is going on? De Vrij, great ball. Oh, Van Arnold cuts it out. See, I don't know what Crystal Palace are doing. They are losing, and they are just not even pushing forward. Here's Coutinho. Can he cut back inside? Can he finesse this? He can. It's six. That's a great goal. Ah, super goal from him. Three changes. Coutinho, Brannigan, Pereira going to go off. And Oxlade Chamberlain, Goretzka and Alexander Arnold are going to come on. Alexander Arnold. Keep it in. Here we go. Bailey. Uh, pull it back. And through. And Chamberlain. And he's at the post. Goretzka. That's just made it seven. Oh my word. Well, this is going to do their confidence, the world of good, so that's something. Liverpool fans there are just not used to seeing this, <laughs> basically. Um, Alex, Alex, uh, Alex Oxley chamberlain was unlucky there, um, hitting the post. And then Goretzka says, yep, yeah, I'll take that. Thank you. I went back to my old formation as well. Uh, as you can see, Barker played well. Bailey, just look at this. Look at the Jonathan Tar with the ten as well. You know what I mean? Look at those numbers. Um, they just played really, really well. And it's a shame that he didn't play that well <laughs> when we were playing against Sports in Lisbon. But you know, hey, Man United have played the game more, so they're only three points ahead of us our defense has been really really good and i mean it showed it in the last game against Crystal palace i mean we stopped them from having um a shot on target at all a shot in any capacity whatsoever hey it's it's positive this is a much more positive video i'm more relaxed i think that's what i need to do is be a bit more relaxed and i think by being more relaxed look what's happened i mean seven seven goals which will help massively towards our goal difference. Um, in fact, we've got the best goal difference. So if it comes down to that, we're, we're, we're doing all right. Um, so seven against Crystal Palace. What a way to end the episode. As I say, guys, 
don't forget to do the poll up there. Um, do you want me to do three games in an episode? I know we're coming to the end of the season, but obviously for next season, this will be the same scenario. If you're worried about the Grinsby career mode, I will sim a lot of that to get us up through the divisions. I will play some games, don't get me wrong, but a lot of that will be sims, so don't worry about that too much, okay, guys? And that will be on a Wednesday, and the Liverpool will still be on the Monday and the Friday. And obviously, depending on how I feel and stuff like that, I might even be able to throw an extra episode in now and again as well. But I massively appreciate your support, guys. You've been absolutely amazing. Um, and the fact that I'm getting new subscribers, you know, I don't know if that's directly from you guys, like letting your friends know. If it is, thank you so much. If you do, please go ahead and subscribe. And if you do like this video and obviously the other videos, go ahead, guys. Hit that like button for me. Just, or just click on it. You don't have to hit it because you, know, you don't want to break your screen. Just, just click it with your mouse or your finger or whatever you're watching this on. Have a great day. I'll catch you next time. This is Dave from Among Gaming. Signing off. Cheers. Sorry about the voice, by the way. <laughs> Cheers.